Hi. Welcome to Love and Forever Evolving, where we are always and forever evolving. Hello, Aquas. Welcome back, my loves. Welcome to your love reading. I hope all has been well, Aquarius. Hope you've been taking care of yourselves. Shout out to the beautiful soul family. Thank you all so much for your continuous love and support. It truly is an honor to have you here, soul family, and evolving right along with me. Thank you so much for your love and support. And welcome back to my returning subscribers as well. Thank you so much for your comments and your feedback down below. I appreciate you. And welcome, Aquarius, to the ones that are new here. Thank you for sharing your time with me today. Definitely, if today's content fulfills your spirit as well, subscribe, Aquarius. We would love to have you here as well, a part of our soul family. And be sure to adjust your notification bells when I do go live on this platform. I do go live throughout the week for all zodiac sign readings as well. All right, so no further ado, Aquas. Let's go ahead and dive into your love life. We're going to go straight into some tarot here to see who is in your energy and why. And then we want to see who's on your mind, right? And how do they feel towards you? Morning angels, ancestors, what do we have for Aquarius placements? The reading here is general Aquarius. Definitely take here what resonates. Please leave it on the table what does not. If you would love to book a personal reading, my email details are down below in the description box, all right? What do we have for Aquarius placements for love? What's going on in Aquarius love life? Let's see about the person here, Aquas, that is on your mind. Tell me about the person here that is on Aquarius's mind right now. Who is Aquarius energy and why? Let's see what do we have for Aquarius? What do we have for Aquarius? Who is on Aquarius mind? Tell me about this person here now. That is on Aquarius' mind. What do Aquarius need to know about this person that is on their mind? <clears throat> what do Aquarius need to know about the person here that is on their mind? Well, what do you need to know is that they're coming in for communication here. This could be a fire sign here, a Sagittarius, a Leo, or an Aries. But you have communication coming in from this person that is on your mind. Uh, some of y'all, this person could be at a distance from you. All right, we have the Queen of Wands. Wow, Leo energy here. Some of y'all, this person may be a Leo or a fire sign here. We got heavy fire placements here with the Eight of Wands and the Queen of Wands. Again, this could be a Leo or this could be a Sagittarius or an Aries here. Someone that wants to reach out to you and um, take action, basically. Regarding this person in your mind, they're very attracted to you. They're ready to take action here towards you, all right? You're definitely going to be getting some communication coming in very quickly from this person here, Aquarius, all right? Let's see what else about this person here that's on Aquarius' mind. Clarify the Queen of Wands and the Eight of Wands. The Eight of Cups. Hmm. The Eight of Cups talks about walking away from a circumstance or a situation that you no longer feel like you resonate with. Or you're no longer emotionally attached to this person here with the Eight of Cups. So some of y'all have decided to walk away from this relationship or this connection here with this fire sign or water sign here as well. We have Scorpio energy here particularly. This is also, um, I'm here in Aquarius. So this is also you Aquarius or the person that you're dating could be Aquarius. But I want to say Scorpio, Cancer, and Pisces energy. But obviously Spirit is indicating to me that some of you all have walked away from this person here. All right, so let's see more insight and details here. And some of you all, the person on your mind, they have walked away from the Queen of Wands energy here. This could be the ex that they have decided to walk away from. 
Tell me more about the person here that is on the Aquarius mind to clarify the Eight of Cups, please. How else does this person that is on Aquarius mind feel at this time? How else does this person feel that is on Aquarius mind? Whoa, the Devil card and the Strength card. Shit. Now I see why this person or you decided to walk away from this uh, marriage. Some of y'all, this was a commitment here with the devil cards here. This could have been a Capricorn or again, this could have been a Leo here. All right. This is definitely someone that is no longer emotionally attached, okay, to this person. This person realized that the behavior pattern in the relationship began to get more and more overwhelming and toxic okay with the devil card here and it took a lot of strength for this person here to walk away from their spouse or whoever that this person was in a commitment here with as i mentioned this could have been uh someone that they were married to or this could have been someone that was the mother or the father of their child here okay Let's see how do you feel about this. Let's see what is your intake Aquarius on this person here that is on your mind. How does Aquarius feel about this person here? Where is Aquarius energy at in this reading today? Wow, we have the Three of Swords here. So some of y'all, again, as I mentioned, you have decided to walk away from this person here as well. So this could be going on on both sides, the person that's on your mind and then as well for you too, Aquarius, for some of you all. Yeah, some of y'all, you're heartbroken by this person here. This person hurt you, <clears throat> who you were in a relationship or a commitment here. So you have decided to move forward here and detach yourself from this person here due to the pain here and the having to overcome the pain here. Yeah, and as you do that, you're going towards a new opportunity here with the Nine of Pentacles. This could be someone new that you're dating or someone that's coming towards you. They could be an earth sign here, a Taurus, a Capricorn, or a Virgo. Wow. So let's see what this person here wants to say. And then at the bottom of the deck here, we have the Wheel of Fortune. Okay. This, again, could be a Sagittarius. We know the Wheel of Fortune card indicates someone that is returning in a situation or an opportunity here that's going to work out in your favor. All right. Wow. So let's see what they want to say. Let's see what is this person hitting feelings towards you right now. Based off of everything here that was channeled out and discussed here, let's see what do they want to say on behalf of the energy here today. What does this person want to say to Aquarius right now? What do Aquarius energy here that surround them want to say? Wow. We have, I hope that you can forgive me one day. Aquarius, all right? So this person that you decided to walk away from in the past here, they hope that one day that you can forgive them. What else about this person here that is on Aquarius mind? What else about this person here? We got, wow, you were the best thing in my life. So this person wants you to know as well that you were always the best person in their life. And then we have, I feel you even though we are apart. So even though you two are separated, even though this has caused pain, this person still does feel you. This person still has feelings for you. And they definitely hope one day that you can forgive them. All right, let's see what else. Wow, yeah, look at that. I'm taking my time with you. So whoever this new person here is, or if this is someone that is wanting to return and work things out here, they're making sure that this time around that they take their time with you. They get to know everything about you. They don't rush the relationship, all right, because they don't want to miss out on anything. That's why I feel like this person wants to take their time here with you, all right? Yeah, look at that. I like the way you treat me. So someone here, you. this could be someone new, as I mentioned, coming in here with this Knight of Pentacles energy as well. 
someone definitely enjoys and loves the way that you treat them wow then we have i am coming to get you <laughs> yeah someone could be at a distance from you that you've met here as well for others of you all and then we have the other woman all right so this could have been involved in a third party situation is why we have the three of swords here this could be what the cause was for this for you or this person removing themselves from this relationship here yeah look at that we have it's time to put this to an end so you're definitely going to have someone that wants to come towards you aquarius and reconcile with you all right and again others of you all you have someone that wants to bring you in a solid offer here all right so let's close out and get you some more advice here aquarius what word advice can Aquarius take away from this reading today? Wow, we have no need to worry. All right, Aquarius, if you were concerned, if you was worried on how this is going to turn out, no need to worry. I feel like everything, again, is going to work out in your favor because we have here the Wheel of Fortune here. And anytime the Wheel of Fortune comes out, this is indicating good luck, uh, things working out in your favor. Whatever that didn't work out in the past is coming back around this wheel in order to work out in your favor. So it's going to give it a win-win outcome for you. All right. Wow, Aquas. I'm going to leave this portion of the reading here. But again, however, if you're new here, welcome, subscribe. We would love again to have you here, part of the Soul Family. Be sure to adjust your notification bells to select all so you're notified every day when I post new content on the channel. Again, if you would love to book a personal reading, my email details are down below in the description box. I am available for personal readings today. If you kind of want to see what's the potential outcome for you and this person or just what's next in love for you. All those details are down below in the description box, loves. And if you're new, again, welcome, subscribe. If you would love to extend your stay, become part of our Patreon family or the OnlyFans page, all those details are on the home page as well, Aquarius. I love you, and I wish you and this person here the best, Aquas. All right? Bye-bye.